We gotta power through the Baron to solve the blood issue. This team really is gonna have to kill the Baron, man. I said that last time, but this team, if we don't, if we don't get it done here, oh, that's gonna be rough. That's gonna be real rough. I'm gonna bring two more shovels. No, that seems unnecessary. All right, here we go. Fair luck. Come on. Come on, man. Let's have a good one here. Let's do it. Let's play well. Let's grab this key and get the frick out of here. Only the first test. Now it must be carried home. They got to have the blood right away. Oh boy. There we are. All right. So we found it, which means I think I just need to go right back down. Thank you for the bonus fight. Appreciate it. She's already craving too. Good lord. Alright, here we go. Thankfully we don't have to worry about the curse this time. We've got a surprise attack to start with too, which is always nice. Yeah, I do think we're pretty damn close to being finished. Thank Christ. It's been tough. Did the game turn itself up again? I swear it did. Silly thing. It didn't turn itself up, but it's just... For whatever reason, sometimes you boot it up at the same volume and it's much louder. Uh... Yeah, we could probably get him killed. Almost. Hey, Anarchy. But now it sounds quiet. What the hell's going on? Maybe it's my crazy brain. My crane. My goodness. Well, alright. Close to what I was gonna do anyway. Alright. Middle middle ground. That'll have to do. And let's see how that works. It's probably gonna be fairly effective. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Come on! The bleed? That seems unnecessary. Well, this has been a poor start. I guess I'll just judgment again. I'm certainly hoping, hoping so too, Tigrav. I... I am really needing a uh, spot of good luck here. And... Well, that'll help. I was gonna—I was about to say so far not so good, but yeah, I gotta count my blessings here. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. All right, let's go for the stun again on this guy. Give ourselves a turn to fix things up. And kaboom! The wounds of war can be healed, but never hidden. All right, we can probably stun him again, actually. Definitely gonna try to. Ooh, wow! Look at that. Well struck. All right, he's dead. That worked. Good stuff. I have to give you the blood, aren't I? A momentary abatement. Oh boy. Hey, good to hear, Command. Be wary. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzy Sounds like fall. a heck of a day already. We're off to a heck of a start, and I'm gonna choose to believe that that bodes well for the rest of the dungeon. Gonna see nothing but success for the rest of the day. Gonna find money on the street. Gonna be elected president. Why would I want that? No, hold on a second. Walk that back. I don't want... Stop. Don't do that. Don't make that happen, okay? I know I kind of have to be, like, actively involved in that one, but don't let me choose to do that, all right? Don't let me accidentally become president. Sorry, I already voted. God damn it. Here it comes. Ugh, all this responsibility. I already got so much on my plate having to play video games professionally. You, got, you think I got time for that? Such a hassle. Oh, you're feeling better, buddy? Alright, good. Uh, I mean, I would like to kill you first, but I guess you're the stress problem. 
precision and power. I mean, he ain't got no stress problem, that's for damn sure. Nice. Speaking of which, okay. Uh, yeah, we might as well try that. Nice. State of the Union is just a crossword puzzle. I'm into that. I, I detect no problems. No, I detect some problems. Forcing way too many people to watch me do a crossword puzzle. It's good with a limited audience, but once you increase that to a to a certain extent. Oh man, people are gonna be furious that I don't know what an epe is. It's Bali, you moron! I actually knew that one. I got that one right. A momentary abatement. Sorry for waking up all the people using these videos to sleep to, by the way. My apologies. It's gonna be a weird part of their dream. Wouldn't that, that, that'd be a fun thing to fuck, fuck with. It's like, be real calm and relaxing for a good, like, 45 minutes to an hour. And then shout something really confusing just to, re just, like, fuck with whatever dream sequence they got going on. Take that tutu off, Tom Cruise! Whoa, okay, now that's... What the hell's happening there? There's, there, there's a new development in the... In the in the brain. That's a lot of stress already. Perhaps the turning point. Two hour stream, the first hour and a half are normal, the final half hour is just yakety sacks over and over. I mean, I, I that sounds like something I would just do anyway. Sounds pretty normal. Hey, Shambler. Who's there? I see a puppy. Come here. I saw you. There you are. Teffy girl, what you doing? You got such a big Teffy cam. You look like you're a darkest dungeon enemy and we have to fight you. Well, I don't want to fight Taffy, go. That's not, okay, yeah, good. Yeah, you run away. That's, that's for the best. That's for the best. And we don't have to fight you. Uh, let's just hit it. As the fiend falls, a faint hope. Hey, we got some blood. That's good. Ooh, I got something. Oh, whoa. Oh, okay. That's yeah. I guess that's pretty good. Can't really be too mad about that. I would definitely prefer the campfire, but that's a decent consolation prize. All right, got our key. Let's do this shit. I guess we're good. Here we go. Oh, uh, naturally, yeah, there would be another hallway. Ah, oh, there it is. Yep, this is it. I remember now. All right. It's time. Definitely time now. Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's do this. Let's do this. Pop a torch. Here we go. Ah, there's a lot of pressure. It would seem his taste for triviality remains unabated. Even now. Okay. I don't even remember how this fight works, but now I'm starting to. Fuck. Well, gotta kill those. Uh-huh. Alan Terry doesn't seem like a good idea, then. We better just focus on killing the things we've already spawned. God damn it. 
That's not gonna work, but might as well do the damage. I'm gonna save the dog treats for a bit. Ah, oh, that was so close. I'm gonna use them, I know, but I know this this fight's gonna go a while, so I'm gonna probably use them in like when we have the Baron exposed. Emboldening Vapors is pretty good. You're dead already. You are close to it with two more damage from the Houndmaster. The speed buff on him so he can act first. That's terrible. God damn it. Well, I might as well do this now. Hey, buddy. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. Okay, now we can start doing dog treat, and we can start hitting this guy. At the bleed, at least. That's really good. I can stun him, right? Yeah, there's a pretty good chance of that. He's got three actions, obviously, but having a stun on one is still pretty helpful. You're dead already. You don't really matter that much. Come on. That sucks. I really should have gone for the bleed then. I guess I really just got to go for the bleed from now on. Ignore the chance of the stun. Stunning the Baron's not going to matter that much anyway. I just said it was going to help a little bit, but I was lying. That Blight chance isn't very good. He's got a lot of resistance too. Son of a bitch. I think maybe I got to use her as a healer mostly. Because he does have a lot of bleed. The slow death. Hmm. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. Okay. That doesn't really matter that much. I don't need to heal. I guess I can try that. I should have moved her back, actually. That would have been a better play. Oh, that's helpful. This isn't going too badly. Pretty pleased with the start, certainly. The bleed resist drop is really helpful. We're going to go for, it for the Houndmaster hit again. That is what we like to see, him buffing the meaningless enemy. Crit chance is up on him, but as long as we avoid that, we're good. We don't have to worry about the curse anymore. The bleed's still there. That's a bad crit. And the bleed. Jesus. Okay, that sucks. Gnawing uncertainty. The birthplace of dread. <sighs> Boy. Let's just pop that. Should have done that on the Plague Doctor if we... Had a turn to do so. Life ebbs, that was fast. Holy shit. Of Maybe one time? Themselves. Yeah, okay. She's got to do a battlefield medicine. She doesn't have a choice. Yikes. Oh, that is huge. Okay, thank you. Get rid of that at least. Might as well pop that. I gotta move her back. Oh, this is the Houndmaster needs to move forward, actually. God damn it. Motherfucker. Come on. Please. Drop that resistance. There we go. This dude's been sticking around the whole damn time, of course, now. That might actually be better for me, though. I don't know. Maybe. Did I have her pop a holy water? I did not. I really want to try that, but the odds are seriously low. Or not really that low, but low enough for me to reconsider it. I don't think the battlefield medicine is even that good of a play, though. I think I'd rather just do this, or maybe even move her back. No, I'd rather you do this and allow the Hounds rush. But... And now uh, the true test. Hold fast or expire. This is terrible. Minimum damage. Come on, bleed at least. Okay, there we go. That's good. Please don't skip your turn. Oh, that's big. Thank you. Wow. Really nice. Okay. That's that. Yeah. 
All right. Here we go. Let's do one at a time this time. That seems smarter. Although the barks for stress are going to be a problem for sure. That uh, hopefully is going to be enough. All right, he's dead. That's good. God damn it. Are you kidding me? At least I'll be able to rearrange, actually, too. I just realized that. I should probably go ahead and move him forward. Because you're already dead. Let's go for the front line now. Resisted the blight. That's not too bad. This is going better, I think. It's just a little damage there. Slowly. Gently. This feels like this the better way to do it, but I can't help taken. but feel like he's probably got some sort of move that he'll just explode out of the egg from at some point. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. But I do still think this is the thing to do. I didn't even pop it? What? Okay. That was weird. I can stun this at least. Or at least there's decent odds of it. So long as it doesn't pop out, I guess this works well. Although again, I can't help but feel like that's gonna happen. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Let's see. Yeah, okay, well, there's that at least. And I can get a big heal off of you. Oh come on, god damn it. All right, well, we get an exsanguinate. Wow, that's nice. I didn't expect that. Okay, I was kind of going to do that anyway, but hey, there we go. That's really helpful. Get an exsanguinate here, which I'm pretty sure I just go ahead and do. Okay. Another... No, we're not going to stun again, obviously. We're going to go... Should I do dog treat now? Probably. Nice. This damage over time is really good. Not gonna stun again. Let's see if I can get this off. Oh, huge. Really timely. That is lowered accuracy. That's gonna be nice. Really nice. Miss it. Wow. Oh, that is low. Oh, that's so lucky. No bleed right now, so I think a stun's a better play, especially with the blackjack. Come on. How is he not getting it? Okay, we got two more dodges. Now we try to lower the bleed resistance again. I guess that's her best play. Huge. And the accuracy debuff. Okay. Another big heal there, unfortunately. And in the DOT, that's huge. She'll be okay. I think it's time to just go for the bleeds. Yeah, definitely. Holy cow. I'm seeing a light at the end of the tunnel. Covered in blood. My blood. With minus 21 accuracy now, though. All right, that's good. Another exsanguinate coming. That makes sense. There can be no hope in this hell. No hope at all. Oh, boy. Nice. Oh. I'm beginning to believe. It's beginning to look a lot like bear wins. 
Da da dee da. Here we go. Oh, big boys this time. Okay. Gotta be careful. One at a time. One at a time. We know how to play it now. We know what to do. Oh, he's done already. That's huge. Let's do it. That's five. We're gonna need another blight there. He's gone. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. And we break through Cocoon 3. Hey, buddy. All right, no stun for you. Just nice, big, fat bleeds. And blights, why not? Spread it around a little bit. And then, well, might as well finish you off. Seems to be doing the job. Oh, you know, it might have actually been a play there to open up the last cocoon because he was already bleeding out and then allow the Vestal to get a group heal off in the final move there. That would have been a better play, in hindsight. Oh well. Get to Exangled in anyway. Big bleed. That's huge for the end game here. Oh, baby. That, oh, that's, a, that's a good feeling in this moment. That feels nice. Let's see about one more bleed for you. No? All right, that's okay. Not too bad, not too bad. We got a bandage. She's stressed out, that's okay. That's what I was gonna do anyway, although I was gonna hopefully do a battlefield medicine maybe, but hey, there you go, there's the DOT. I've seen such horrors already. It's all right. You hug that pooch. It'll. It's almost over. It'll all be over soon. Judgment calls. And the blight shall finish. And ladies and gentlemen, the Baron has been felled. The jig is up. The game is done. Yes. Yes. Oh, man. That is good. That is good, 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 good. Yippee. No need for that. No need for that. Okay. Oh. Man, that is nice to see on this dungeon. That's been a long time coming. Holy shit. Oh, yeah. What is that? I don't remember. Holdium! 44 months on the bear pile. Thank you for the sub. Bam, bam. Red key. There's a loot room somewhere, right? Further south. Then you fight two gators. Oh, whoops. Oh, no, I hit the button. Hey, we win. I did it. Do, 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 do. I don't know, I was done there anyway. No need for any further courtyard antics. Holy hell. And a little... This is gonna feel good. Yeah! Clouds from the courtyard have abated. Mm. The heirs of the estate feel narrowly agreeable once again. No more curse. Oh man, that's a relief. That's nice. Whew. Hmm. Well, let's go ahead and get you guys situated. Time to stress heal. 
goodness. Well, he can't go anywhere, sadly, but... Thankfully, he's in pretty good shape anyway. Oh, yeah, sure is stagecoach time, huh? Oh, my God. The campaign can wait. For now, carnage calls. Oh, another one. Oh, my. I do not have any low-rank Vestals right now. There's a leper as well. That is not a bad idea. I do already have Henry. Yeah, I think I'm probably going to go ahead and pick up this Vestal here. A sister of battle. Pious and unrelenting. Hey, Benohawk. Let's pop a quick pick me if you all are keen. Exclamation point. Or sorry, no exclamation point. Just pick me. That's all you got to do. P-I-C-K-M-E, all one word. That'll enter you into the drawing. Moobot. We'll select name from chat. And we'll rename this Vestal after you. For now, I do believe it's probably time to take on one of these apprentice level bosses we have remaining. Wouldn't mind going up against the flesh. This is sort of a gimme fight, usually. Hell, I'll take an antiquarian into this fight. Level zeros. See how much I give a shit. See if I give a single fuck. I don't care, man. I'll do what I want. Throw a vessel in there? Sure, why not? Looks good to me. Mirror seems pretty damn good. Yeah, this will be nice going up against the uh, courtyard enemies. Yeah, Flesh is a really easy boss fight. Definitely the easiest, in my opinion. Oh, do we have the Jester's full set? No, I don't think so. I don't think we have any full sets yet. No, we do. We have the Occultist set. Oh, shit, let's go. Totally gonna bring an Occultist this time. What does it even do? Added speed and damage below Torch 60. Stun chance. Ooh, those are fun. Those are fun. Look at that. Lead skill chance lower. Who cares about that? Nice. Looks like we're going in the darkness. This will be a hoot. Flagellant. Oh, if only we had your extra one. That'd be nice. But I guess we got a pretty good combo for you already. Go ahead and grab those for you. Well, my ancestor's candle's probably going to be way better than that. And then kaboom, and then... Yeah. Sure. Works for me. Turns that into a, a heal for two. Not bad. And this new Vestal, who we're not going to bring yet, but eventually we'll bring out. Who's that going to be? That's going to be Naki Cappuccino. Naki Cappuccino. Do -do 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 -do. Welcome to the squad. Good to have you. Alrighty. Let's go fight the Flash. This will be nice. A nice little... Uh... God. I keep saying this is going to be easy. I'm just absolutely guaranteeing that it's going to be a chaotic nightmare. I gotta stop saying it. Uh, let's go ahead and upgrade the furnace. A sharper sword, a stronger shield, anything to prolong a soldier's life. I like knocking this out early, so I'm gonna go ahead and do this now. In the end, every plan relies upon a strong arm and tempered steel. Yes, sir. Fortifying vapors upgrade, blight chance upgrade. You, I guess, are going to take Adder's Kiss's upgrade, and then... I do kind of want to upgrade the training regimen as well. We have zero portraits right now, though. You can trade heirlooms. Yeah, it's really nice. That's uh, not always been in the game. That was a later edition. Only when I get a new person, Celestial. Which, of course, at this point in the campaign is uh, a lot less frequent. Alright, I guess we're good. Oh, I do want to go unlock Lash's Solace on you as well. 
Here we go. Oh man, upgrading this would be nice too, actually. I probably should go ahead and... Oh, I should have done that a long time ago. I don't know why I haven't. Success depends on survival. I'm gonna get a billion crests anyway. I'd like to save a lot of money there. Okay, cool. Oh wait, hold on. She's got snake skin that I really like. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get that as well. Uh huh. And snake eyes is actually really nice too. And I've already got an ambush prevention, I think. Or no, I don't. I do. Yeah, unspeakable commune. And then oh, I'll have to do. All right, cool. Let's do it. I'm ready. No torches this time. A few shovels, or a couple shovels anyway. A couple of each of these. A couple of herbs. A couple of holy waters. Cool. Hit it. My zeal for blood rituals and summoning rites had begun to ebb, as each attempt invariably brought only failure and disappointment. Progress was halting, and the rapidly accumulating surplus of wasted flesh had become burdensome. Burdensome. The thing is more terrible than I can describe. An incoherent jumble of organ, sinew, and bone. bone. That's kind of a weird layout, but okay. Let's go this way, I guess. Mm -hmm. Careful, buddy. God damn it. Carelessness will find no clemency in this place. There's a lot of stress already. No wonder I'm so uncomfortable. Ugh, here we go. That's more like it. Hey, Kaiju, how you doing? I got a holy water for that, right? Totally. Which occultist is this? That is point of view, man. Whose skills I did not look at at all. I probably should have addressed that. He's got some weird shit. <laughs> That's gonna be kind of a kind of an unhelpful character. Oh well. Oh cool. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles. No. Paid for in blood. No. Back to the pit. Wow, can't believe that actually landed. Damn it. The slow death unforeseen. Books don't Unforgiven. typically have gold. I'm pretty sure that was only because we interacted it or we interacted with it with an antiquarian. Reeling. That's absolutely why that showed up. I'm pretty sure that's why the Onyx showed up too. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Bleed! Not enough though. There Another we go. Another one falls. All right. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. And then two more rooms with a scout to boot. Cool. Let's hit it. Problem. Still plenty of food. This has been a real easy dungeon so far. Don't mind this one bit. And I'm really welcoming death, but continue the onslaught. Destroy them. I mean, when they present me with this kind of stuff. I can't really feel that threatened. He's welcoming this shit. That's what he wants. Goodbye. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. Yeah, might as well. Yeah, super effective. All right, yeah, he was supposed to be like effective with damage too. I really fucked that up. <laughs> oh well. God damn it. 
feel welcome death, that makes sense, yeah. This advantage. Give them no quarter. There we go. Should have brought me, I guess so, doll, yeah. Clearly made a mistake there. Healing for three is the antiquarian, my goodness. Look at you go. So is this like a torchless, deathless run? Yeah, minus that deathless Slowly, bit. Gently. This is how a life is taken. And not the whole run, just right now. Cool. That doesn't really matter. I forget that's what that does. Let me go ahead and clear this hallway and then we'll camp out and do the fight. The darkness holds much worse than mere trickery and boogeyman. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. All right, camping time. A moment of respite, a chance to steel oneself against the coming horrors. Prevent the ambush. Reduce the stress. Snake skin and oh, I didn't actually. God damn it! I unlocked snake eyes. I didn't equip it though. Son of a bitch. Oh well. I guess I'll do Adder's Embrace. That's probably fine. And some food. Cool. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted and purpose is made clear. Okay. Let's do it. Nice, easy flash fight. What could possibly go wrong? Squirming. Contorting and ever expanding. This horror must be unmade. I mean, they even gave me an easy start. Two exposed units. I don't like that I said that. I definitely should have had Impale equipped here, too. That would have been a much better option. I didn't prepare for this at all, because I always consider this fight to be more or less a given. Probably gonna regret that. That's probably fine. I'm gonna go for the Serpent Sway after I bandage her. Probably try. I don't even have. Oh, I do have festering vapors. Okay, thank goodness. That eh, would have been silly. I don't need to really do an anti venom there. I don't need to do anything but festering. Hmm. Yeah, we'll bandage that. I gotta do a serpent sway. She is marked right now. Here we go. Reign of Sorrows by itself is going to win this fight so easily. That's how easy this fight is. It's actually probably going to be more or less the only offense that we have the entire time. Especially if they keep targeting her, I'll just keep Serpent Swaying and then we'll just tank damage the whole fight. Nice. Remember when bleed was triggered for all sections at the same time? Yeah, it used to be even easier. It's honestly just kind of crazy. Like if you were to do a tier list of difficulty for every Darkest Dungeon boss, this would have its own tier, like three below the bottom one. I'm gonna die is the thing like I, I've said so I've talked so much shit about this boss so far I'm gonna die I have to I deserve it how quickly the tide turns that's not good like I feel like I deserve it It's going slow, certainly, but again, we're in, like, no danger at all. Really not concerned. Kind of want to do the kiss, but I should just do that. Over the stab. 
Oh, on Champion, it's a little bit different. Like, this is the Apprentice Flesh. I'm speaking specifically about the Apprentice Flesh right now. I probably should have made that distinction, but no, it's it it's a little... It can be mildly challenging on Veteran and Champion. Everything's hard on Champion. The wounds of war can be healed, but never hidden. The Apprentice Flesh in particular, though, is just not... Not really a big deal. What was your reaction to the fact that there will be a Darkest Dungeon 2? General merriment. Glee. Jubilation. Other words for happiness. Extremely giddy. Stop it. Human emotions. We all experience them. None of us are robots. Kind of hurting a little. Flag doesn't matter. I guess I'll just heal up the occultist. Good work, buddy. I really should have given you the healing buffs. Ow. Unbalanced. That hurt. Alright, how we doing? Pop a heal. There we go, we're good. We're good. Nice big bleed up front. Get this going again. Okay. That's pretty bad. I think Adder's Kiss is the way to go now. Yeah, definitely. Oh boy, that sucks. Thank you very much. That would have been a problem. I was actually worried there. Okay. This dude is not doing great with the heals. Captivate, I guess, is pretty good. Eh, it's good. We got it. All good. It is as grotesque in death as it was in life. No problem. GG. Foolish horrors. Brought low and driven into the mud. Okay. Just gonna pop a few HP boosts. That's what these are known as. Uh is it worth it? Probably. Yeah, let's see if we can get a couple more things. God damn it. Yeah. That sucks. This is Blood Moon. Oh, I got no torches either, son of a bitch. Oh, positive quirk? Let's go! Cool. Alright. This was your signal to stop. I know! I'm so bad at listening to those, especially lately. Tron Schwinge! Thank you for the 28 months of the bear pod. Welcome on back and appreciate it. Bear hugs if you got them. Thank you for the subscription. We're gonna go through that hall, and then maybe that hall, and then maybe that hall. The only danger we have really right now is this tile, and we're good. Now I'm dead. Cruel machinations spring to life. God damn it! Singular purpose. What is it that's making you do that? Demon mania. I'm gonna get rid of that. Now I gotta get rid of scurvy. That's probably fine. Please don't touch it. God fucking damn it, dude. It's every single time with this guy. Jesus Christ. 
Oh, good. Now it's gonna happen even more. Fuck! Okay, fine, I'll go! God! Leave me alone! Jesus Christ! Oh, okay, never mind, I'm cool. We got it. Oh, you're full? Oh, alright then. How about now? No? Still full? You're gonna bleed to death, you know that. Huh. Well, one more curio. Hacks Blood? Laden with loot are often low on supplies. Yeah, it's just gonna be in freaking death's door, dude. And now the darkness oh holds dominion. Black as death. Okay, bye. That was fun. Made a little money. Killed the flesh. All good. Cool. Yeah, those were like level zero characters too. This is what I'm talking about, man. You don't need a lot to kill the flesh. If you need a good confidence boost, a good morale boost early on in the run, go for a flesh fight. It'll, it'll probably go great. Plotter's nice. Clumsy sucks. That flagellant's got problems, dude. The poor caretaker. The poor caretaker. I fear his long-standing duties here have affected him. The poor bear taffy. Hmm. There is another plague doctor. They have one, two, two plague doctors. Don't need any of those, really. I think we're gonna leave that bunch as well. Hey, coffee. Hey, Ward. Ever thought of rapping about Darkest Dungeon be great with some Wayne June samples? Uh, yeah. No, I'm not really like a, like a Dan Bull type. Like, I love Dan Bull, don't get me wrong. He's dope. Um, but, like, the songs about games has not really ever been something that's, like, super appealing for me. I like just making the songs about whatever. About whatever comes to mind. General rap music. We're just doing back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back bosses today. We go ahead and hit that siren up too. Why not? Why not, right? Let's build the the total blight team and just go ham on this sucker. If we have one anyway. I guess I have a leper for this. We could use an occultist here again. Or I could use a fresh vestal. I'd probably still be fine. Yeah, it's probably fine. Let's do that. Not a ton of blight, but still, still pretty good. This is gonna be funny when the leper is charmed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it will be. We'll all get a good laugh. All right. Yeah, we have the Baron's last trophy now. Yeah, probably never gonna use it. Definitely gonna give you the candle. And I guess I like the blighting satchel for you. It's fairly good. I know what you're getting. Fairly sure what you're getting. Um Yeah. And then the leper with the big damage buffs. There we go. All right, well, first of all, let's go fix up the flagellant from last time. Assuming we... Oh, did we commit him? We did, didn't we? I think we did. Yep. All right, well, we're going to have to fix that next time. Oh, wait, we, we put him in the sanitarium. Yeah, duh. I'm an idiot. I already did that. Okay, cool. All right. Let's do it. Money's looking better, at least. Now, that's nice. Bring a full fucking stack of herbs. 
And then a lot of bandages, a lot of anti-venom. Torches as well. Alright. Sounds good. Let's do it. Third boss in a row. Might as well. My lofty position wasn't always accompanied by the fear of office. And there was a time when I could walk the streets or raise a glass in the tavern without concern for molestation. Faithful as the tide, one precocious village waif made it her hobby to shadow my every errand. It was charming then. Troublesome later. Ooh. I always wondered what became of the unfortunate little whiff. Here we go. This one's gonna be harder. A lot harder than the last one, that's for damn sure. And yeah, Ares was not wrong. If the leopard gets taken, we are kind of fucked. So I hope that I hope that doesn't happen. That'd be really bad. Go thrall first. Impressive. After the stress damage is taken care of, of course. I just never expect her to get hit. See? That's the usual stuff. 10% stun resist. Ooh, almost. Cove music is indeed banging. At all times. As the fiend falls, bops abound. Faint hope blossoms. There now. There you go. Let's hop off our grave robber. Feeling good. I do not have the right skills equipped on this vestal. God damn, I really should have been checking on that. <laughs> Although, you know, actually, in this particular composition, Mace Bash might be okay. It might work out. We'll see. Confidence surges God, I really need to start crumbles. looking into that. I keep assuming that we're already set up. Being a big old goofus. That's pretty good. Let's start with the... Uh, let's get the backliner again. One play grenade is probably close to killing there. I got it. Nice. Ah, four damage. Definitely revenge time here. We're gonna pop a stun on the damage dealer. No, never mind. 10% resistance on that guy. There's an XCOM shot for you. He's already dead at least. It's not that bad. I can't decide if these guys are, if the Guardians are more threatening than the Groupers. I think I never quite knew was when Torchlight is checked when entering a room. Is it still early enough when the fade to black already starts? Um, I don't know. I assume, well, because you can add a torch before you even do something like this. Like, if the torch were low right now, I could modify it. I'm assuming that it takes effect only at, like the the level it is at when the monsters are attacking i'm pretty sure is what matters that's my understanding anyway i could confirm that but death by inches. seems logical to me eh fuck it super leper again why not very glad to have at least one heal Alright, he's doing work again. Matters for surprise versus versus shuffle, but exactly when that happens, I don't know. Oh, yeah. Well, I suppose that would probably be, like, right before that happens, then. So if you use the torch before that, then I think that would contribute to it. He should be dead now. Let's go, Leper. 
Oh, right. Yeah, it's the other guy still. I forgot. Nice. The slow death. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. Yeah, these guys just always take a year and a half to kill. He's already dying. It's good stuff. We'll heal her one more time, and then the leper will self-heal. Go ahead and get rid of the bleed, too. Why not? Why not? Which bug, if turned giant, would be the scariest? I love this question, apropos of nothing. Oh, it's, I, you recently watched Kong, it's all you can think this of. Okay, that makes sense. Taken. Praying Mantis is up there for me. Those things would be scary as shit. That sucks. Thankfully, we have that. Centipedes would be awful. Yeah, goddamn, that would be a nightmare. A fortune waiting to be spent. Mosquitoes, too. I still remember the scene from Jumanji of the giant fucking mosquito things uh, lunging their proboscis through the roof of the car the kids were in. That shit scared the hell out of me, dude. Oh god, wasps would be a nightmare, yeah. Pretty much any bug. Any bug. Name a bug is basically the chat right now. Butterfly, God, yeah, no, you, I mean, like, it would be beautiful if you only saw it from the back. Great Turn that thing around, that, that is, I mean, you've seen Spongebob. I know you have. You're here. You saw the episode where they do the close-up of the fly, it's terrifying. Or not the fly, the butterfly. Miss. Ah, shit. Worm, ride it like a mount. Okay, worms. Worms, I could maybe accept. Hey. Executed with impunity. Worms could be fun. But what if worms end up being terrifying at extreme, extremely large sizes? Something, something, Dune. Continually onslaught. Destroy them all. Worms aren't really Another a bug, though. Well, yeah, that's fair. Another misfortune. What are worms? Earthworm. A terrestrial invertebrate that belonged to the phylum Annelida. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Google. Now I understand everything. Hey, there we go. Who's got a quirk? You do. Let's get rid of yours. Nice. Hey, that's the one I wanted. Sweet. Yeah, sorry, Hazrin. Already cleared it. You'll have to be a VOD boy. That stress is not looking good on the Vestal already. Brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. Mm, yeah. Seems wise. Chop is more than likely gonna kill you here, but since he already took his action, I suppose I might as well just. Well, no. Destroy. Let's still kill him. That's still a good choice. Ah, come on. God damn it. Dodge for a dodge, right? Yeah, I was gonna say, that's only fair. And then you can have your hit. Yeah, go ahead. I'll just heal. Hey, Omelette. I did, JD. I'm feeling fresh. Although I do keep missing the opportunity when people ask me that to say, No, it all just fell out like this. Fucking wild, huh? Really convenient for me that it looks so good. Therefore. 
formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Bonk. This expedition at least promises success. I'm feeling fresh as hell, dude. Elisa's a new place of employment gives really nice haircuts, it turns out. Oh, shit. Secret room. Going back. Hold up. Hold up. Gimme, 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 gimme. Money, 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 money. I don't even need to go that way. Ha ha. You thought you caught me, but little did you know. I'm only backtracking a little bit. Nice. If only treasure could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption. Very good. All right. Get the hell out of here. Money, 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 motherfucker. The match is struck. A blazing star is born. All right. I'm like halfway there. Oh, we're halfway there. Whoa, boss fight with bear. Built his team, but forgot to prepare. Whoa, boss fight with bear. There we go. Ah, crap. Well, I might as well just kill him, I guess. Get close to it. Stun? Yeah. Ow. Easy now. We got this. Quick little hue. Wipe this up. Nice big blight on this feller. Four damage. We got that from a hue. That's easy. It's easy, dude. Don't get to stun me anymore. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Naturally, we would do three damage there. Ow. It's all right. We got to play, doctor. So good at that. That's actually ideal. There we go. All fixed. You're dead. You're near to it. Thankfully, didn't have to worry about the bleed there. Let's go ahead and top off the leper. Feels pretty good. Eradicated. Okay. All fixed. God damn it. All right, at least we get to kill him before he acts. And we'll take the portrait. Success so clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Thank you very much. Let's see what that is. Glittering right. gold, trinkets and baubles. Paid for in blood. Another fight immediately. Get the surprise here. Let's start with a blight. No, let's kill the back line. I don't want them being a part of this one. Stun you. The light, the promise of safety. Go for revenge. Hopefully two turns on this guy. Prone dagger should be enough damage to take him out. Back end of horse. Think of the 14 months on the bear pile. We got bear hugs. I love to see bear hugs for the returning subscriber. 
Thanks for the support. Appreciate it. One shot chop coming up as a result of the subscription. That's okay. It was a possibility, which is pretty cool. This leper is nutty, as always. The blood quickens. I mean, when you've got a 69% damage buff, that'll friggin' do it. Just size alone does not dissuade the sharpened blade. Nice. Uh, no more keys needed, I guess. Cut to he needs a key. Uh, nah. I'm happy with basically everything I've got at this point. I'm gonna use the camp at the very end if I can. Hopefully just got an empty room from this point on. Plenty of food for that. Well, not really. That's actually the only hunger trigger I can stand. Got a shovel. Backpack might have some food in it. As the light gains purchase, spirits mm. are lifted and purpose is made clear. That's not very exciting, unfortunately. All right, not too bad of a fight at the end, too. What did I do here? I think I did the throne dagger into the play grenade and then the throne dagger on him, right? Yeah, that sounds right. That sounds right. A powerful blow. Yeah, a lot less frustrating than yesterday for sure, Quist. The bar was pretty low there. I'm feeling like things are going a lot better. I already took out a couple of bosses today. Took out the Baron and cleared the curse, so I'm already feeling way better as a result of that. And that makes me feel good too. Yeah, I think things are turning around a little bit. Got a shovel for that too, right? Yeah, totally. Okay, you're not dead. I think I'd like to kill you first. How quickly can you dispel the curse? Once you kill the Baron, uh, the curse is completely lifted from your party. God damn it. really hoping for a crit. Alright, so he's already dead. A lot of extra damage we could have avoided. Hey, speaking of avoiding it. With zero dodge somehow. That's incredible. Definitely get a battlefield medicine that. We're gonna probably go for a, a direct heal there too. Nice. Thanks, Rouch. Appreciate it. Fix you up. Uh, I think, I mean, it takes a while to prepare usually, Dank. For me, at least, I usually take a while to get all the invitations before I can get in there, and especially to level up the characters necessary to get in there and clear it out. The courtyard can take a long, long time. That's a busy hallway, holy shit. A handsome reward. Hmm. For a task well performed. I don't need that. Money's a lot less important now that we have the bank, thankfully. I'm really feeling good about that. I think this is another anti-venom, right? Yeah. Alright, that'll help a little bit. Oh, I should have given that to the leper, actually. That would have been better. Oh, well. Alright, one more fight. We gotta do that. I'm just gonna go for the leper one shot. And then definitely gonna heal here. He's way too low right now. Looking like double spearfish killing. Hey, that's huge. Okay, good stuff. Good stuff. Alright, see the slash up front. I might actually go for the uh, self-heal on the leper now, too. I could probably get away with it with the Noxious Blast if that lands. Eh, it's not enough. It'd be kind of risky, but I'm going to do it anyway. Might have to heal her, too. Yup, definitely. That was kind of not worth it. Kind of not worth it at all. Oh well. Hey, more food. That's good. Ghoulish horrors 
Okay. Brought low and driven into the mud. Yeah, no, didn't forget the camp. We're just clearing the hallway out first. So we lose minimal torchlight and don't get any surprises, ideally. Returned. Mercy meow! 11 months on the bare pile. Thank you very much for the resubscription. Gathered close in tenuous firelight and uneasy companionship. At least these guys have really good camping skills. That's always good to see. Um, although I don't have the ambush prevention, do I? No. Damn it. Hmm. Well, let's get rid of her stress. Does one have disease? No. I'm gonna take some buffs here. I'm gonna go reflection. Don't need night moves anymore. Um. Yeah, reflection bloody shroud. Okay. And then we'll just give the leper four food at the end of this hallway if we don't have a hunger trigger. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. All right then. Buffing leper is double-edged sword if she takes him. Absolutely, but at the same time, I mean, like, we're kind of living or dying by the leper at this point, so we might as well go all in on him, I think. All right. Here we go. Let's do it. Oh. The aquatic devils Just gotta basically the cross our fingers here. Their image. She is their queen. And their slave. I almost want to do a Toxin Trickery start, but I can always use that as a Blight or Bleed Cure, too. That's good. Okay. Didn't take the Leper. Still not ideal, but definitely better. Hey, we can Mace Bash now, so right, yeah, that's actually kind of useful. But she's... No, she's not unholy. Okay, I was going to say, that'd be really, really good. We can stun her, though. Or at least we got a decent chance. Alright, Leopard. Do your thing, buddy. That hurts. Keep on buffing. Got that 69% damage. I love that that's where it ends up. It's so funny. Can't use the herb for that debuff, sadly. Pretty good. Plague Doctor's in a bit of a pickle here, though, considering we can't directly heal her from that spot. I really think I should keep trying to go for that stun. That seems like a pretty damn good idea. Oh, there we go. Now we can just move her forward. Wow. Okay. That'll be a third of her HP. Uh, let's just do this. That feels like a better idea. And then... Just bandage it. Fuck it. Strike. There we go. Yeah, I think we're okay now. Pop a heal. <laughs> Leper's got an appointment he's got to keep. Yeah, no, he's, he's busy. He doesn't have time for this shit. A decisive pummeling. Grave robber, too, apparently. Well, that was easy. Staples easy button on that one. Especially now. Good lord. Yeah, that's just a fucking insult to injury there. Goodbye. Hideous matriarch. Bio queen of the aquatic depths. Alright. There's no place in the sane world. I mean, we had two possible results for that thing, right? It was gonna be the leper gets taken, we get fucking obliterated, or she doesn't take the leper and it's easy as hell. So, thankfully we got result two. <laughs> Alright, let's get the hell out. Yay!
We did it. And they've got the secret room there, too. Yeah, the Siren can definitely be a, a swingy fight, like you're saying, for sure. It can be really, really difficult, depending on the luck of the draw there. Oh, wow. What? Cool. Holy shit, that's dope. Her heals on herself are 25% more effective. That's amazing. We almost have enough money to consider. Yeah, we Women totally have enough money men, to lock that in. Soldiers and outlaws, fools and corpses. All will find their way to us now that the road is clear. Absolutely. I probably should have gotten rid of the yips too while I was doing that. That would have been a good idea. Oh well. It's weird she says ascetic as well. That's kind of funny to have those two on the same character. I also should probably unlock that skill on her. But hey, there we go. Let's see. I can get rid of... Where is that... Flagellant now? There you are. Take you into the sanitarium. Oh, right. No, yeah, duh. Of course, don't have the second slot open. No diseases now either, and I don't think there's much stress to address either besides Harbinger. There we go. Oh, cool. Let's check the stagecoach. There's a highwayman. I should probably get another highwayman. I've only got the one. Plenty of healers, yeah, if we ever needed another one of those. I don't think we actually do at this point, though. We've got one... I guess I could use another occultist. I only have the one occultist. I don't think I need another bounty hunter. I don't really like the bounty hunter. I could go for another occultist, I guess. Let's see which one's the best. We got three of them here, for God's sake. What happened to me? You should have two. Oh no, did you die? Uh-oh. <laughs> Sorry you had to find out this way. Apparently you had a heart attack in week 33 due to unsustainable stress. Ooh, Ruins Tactician. Nymphomania. Ooh, Deadly and Robust. Yeah, that's the one. Welcome aboard, buddy. To fight the Abyss, one must know it. Let's do a pick me. Brand new, fresh pick me. P I C K M E, all one word in chat. Rename the Occultist here. Figure out what the heck is next. These veteran dungeons are calling my name now. I think we're heading back to the ruins. Maybe taking on the necromancer soon. That seems like the way to go. You have returned. Direct to you. Thank you for the full year on the pile. Appreciate it. I wouldn't mind seeing things turn out that way, certainly. Thank you for the resub. Very kind. We're going with the Blight, baby. Give me that Shield Breaker. Throw a Grave Robber in that mix. And then... I mean, I do kind of feel like I should have a Vestal. But I also want to do that. That sounds like fun. Just all kinds of Blight. We do need to spend some money unlocking skills and such for this squad, and especially upgrading our Plague Doctor here. There we go. Into the guild with him. Impale's ready. Oh, actually, her skills are all good to go, huh? Yeah, she's got it all set. Just expose, really. I gotta level up the guild. I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need a lot more portraits and crests. Get these skills leveled up. Oh, thank you, Prime. I did forget. Yeah, I appreciate that. I'll probably do those at the end of the stream. Or probably I'll, I'll do them between Darkest Dungeon and, and the Crossword. That was a good plan, I think. I guess there's not going to be a lot to do in the guild then, unless, well, yeah, the level 3 of these is going to be worthwhile. Let's take that. And then 
the grave robber. Uh, she's already good too. You gonna do farmstead this run, bear? Possibly. Decent chance of it. I've looked at those trinkets and they're worth getting, so. For that alone, I might be tempted. Alright, let's do this. Let's get this shit. Let's get this shit. Let's get this shit. I'm not the only one who's seen the clip going around on YouTube of Spongebob doing the Kendrick verse off the new Baby Keem album. Top of the morning, top of the morning, top of the morning. <laughs> that shit's in my head all the fucking time, dude. Of Spongebob saying top of the morning, top of the morning. <laughs> so goddamn stupid. Bounty candy bars, yes or no? I don't know if I've ever had one. I can't, I can't say I have, actually. Ooh, the crit increase on the range skills, the manacles upgrade? Oh, snap, that's kind of fun. The weird position one damage boost for this guy, too. What a strange trinket. What a strange person. Um, I don't have great trinkets for these guys, unfortunately. I, th I don't think you can use manacles in position one, yeah, which is why I consider that such a bizarre trinket. Very weird. Just get the broken tree, or the bro broken key trinket, disgustingly OP for the abomination. Okay, maybe. Maybe, maybe we look into that. Yeah, no, I am definitely thinking about it. About the possibility. Let's rename this, uh, Occultist real quick. Oh, that's a wonderful name. I'm very glad that was chosen. Welcome to the team, Fancy Lad Snack Cakes. <laughs> nope, that's it. That's his name. That's the character limit, so be it. <laughs> All right. I think her skills are good too. Yeah, no, we're all set. This looks right. Let's hit it, man. Off to the ruins. Let's bring the plight or bring the blight team. See how they fare. Big ass stacks of food. Definitely not going torchless here. I'll bring a few bandages. Couple of herbs, a few holy waters, shovels, keys. Cool. Sounds good. The Baron has been slain. Yes. Knocked it out first thing today. Can the defiled be consecrated? Can the fallen find rest? Yeah, probably. There we go. All right, let's see how this goes. You know, now that I think about it, that trinket, this has got to be all about, these are all melee. What the hell? This is so weird. It's such a weird trinket, dude. I don't understand that at all. At least we can do that to cycle the abomination to spot too. That's pretty nice. Didn't really think about that. I should probably kill him. Nice. Slowly, gently. This is how a life is taken. That was a really easy starting fight, but. Oh, right, yeah. I can expose him. I didn't think about that. Damn, I really like this team already. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. 
OP team or false confidence? I guess we'll find out once we find our first, like, actual fight instead of a three-man softy. That's a... <laughs> I don't like thinking about what the hell that is. That's a euphemism for something I'd, li I'd rather not get involved in. Yeah, I already got a full inventory too, God. At least we got that early on. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded oh, hey, buddy. And the fool hardy alike. You're here early. I guess I do have a full inventory, don't I? All right, well, let's do it. Here we go. That's a big blight, too. Yeah, it certainly, it certainly seems like the thing to do. Okay, yeah, that makes sense, Robin. It's not meant to bolt or not meant to buff both things at once. It's meant to be used in, you know, multiple ways. Okay, sure, yeah, I get it. A devastating blow. I don't think I necessarily want to use the emboldening vapors all that much here. Rage is definitely going to be good. He's already basically dead. I love being able to target the back line with her too. It's super nice. That's helpful. As long as I can get this plague grenade off, man, I'll be feeling good. I guess a rake is pretty good here, actually. This guy's already... Oh, he wasn't dead. Shit, I don't know why I thought he was. I... Oh, I'm going for the plague grenade. That's right. Oh, that's huge. Big plays. Big plays. Let's go. Oof. Blow to body and brain. Now that's a huge problem considering I can't actually heal her with anything but a battlefield medicine. So I probably wanted to do something like a like a serpent sway to prevent that. I'm definitely going to do that now. In fact, oh, I don't even have that. Oh gosh, she doesn't even have that fucking unlocked. That's a big goof. Whoopsie. Oh well. Yeah, that's going to be a problem. He's already almost dead. Healing for one does nothing. We're just gonna have to get lucky here, I think. And well, actually, if we can rage, oh boy, that's not too bad. Rage will do it. A predator is often blind to. Yeah, right, that wasn't too bad. We just gotta be really careful about our shield breaker. The will to fight. She's definitely the one that's in the most danger. Hey, there's number two. Nice. Cool. And a good scout. Wow. Oh my god. The scout was a holy shit. This is so good. Yay. Good. Dude, Jesus Christ, this is amazing. Especially considering we're doing this right when we have the inventory space for it. Holy shit. It's all coming up. BTAF, dude, this is great. We've got like one more fight. This isn't even a battle. Love to see it. Free torch, why not? A fortune waiting to be spent. Yeah, I already killed the collector too, right? Yeah, there's like very little danger now. That's kind of a bad fight, but hey, we surprised him. Can expose this dude. I'm gonna lunge crit this guy. Oh, come on. I have to be super confident about it, fine. I don't even know why I don't know why I did that. I don't even want to do that. It's not even a threat right now. The ground quakes. All right, well, that could have been better. Oh, actually, no, he is the biggest threat. Now that I think about it, the stress damage is the least concerning part of this expedition. 
I want to kill him first, so yeah, that was the right play. Good, good job, Barry. You knew what you were doing. Good spread of damage, too. Yeah, naturally. Yeah, I guess I have to do that. I'm going to transform here. If he gets first action. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Do, 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 do. Definitely go for that. Oh man, that's unlucky. I guess we're gonna have to kill him with this. Alright. Nice. The slow death. Unforeseen. Well that went well. A lot better than I thought it would. Might be able to pop a little bit of healing here. A death. Bear always spreads the love, absolutely. You know me. Definitely absolution here. Hopefully he'll uh, choose to target our abomination for the most part. So far, so good. That doesn't really matter. Ah, eh, stun's fine. I'll just lunge here for the crit chance. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. All right, cool. Um, well, you know what? Fuck it. Camp out. Gathered close in tenuous firelight, an uneasy companionship. We're gonna go like that and like that. There we go. Oh yeah, I guess I don't need the shovel either. Yeah, I could have done that. Good call. Oh well. Hmm. Well, I mean, the stress isn't really even an issue here. Good snake eyes, certainly. I don't have any ambush prevention, unfortunately. Uh, let's just do this. Go with this, that. And the encourage. There we go. Cool. Oh, if only I could... God damn it. Wish I could select these people so I could eat the food. That would have been nice. Yeah, I had a feeling. Oh! Oh, of course, we're in a veteran. I didn't think about that. Duh. Alright, we got a little bit more to deal with then. Thankfully, we can actually uh, expose these guys. That's going to help a lot. Uh, their blight resistance is extremely high, though. It's not going to happen. This is definitely going to be a good idea, though. That's very good. This is actually really dangerous. Really glad to have at least the DOT removal here. We're going to go for the rage kill on this guy. Decimated. That'll work. Anti-venom. That's a lot of damage, though. That sucks. Gotta keep exposing. Damn it, how you doing? I guess we do that. And then rake. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Okay, we're getting there. I don't feel like I should heal. But that's pretty good, too. Yeah, it's awesome. Good to hear. Nice. Okay. That's certainly ideal, especially with his resistance. And they're both exposed now. I think I'll take the guaranteed kill. Destroy. Seems like the right move. There we go. Let's do it. All right. Wow. Success so clearly in view. Look at that loot. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Ba boom, ba boom. Uh, I don't need three torches anymore. I'm about to use the key. I like those Aegis scales. I don't need the herbs. All right, that'll do. Good enough. 
All right. Um, bandages. Great. What a dungeon. Good stuff. Went really well. In radiance, may we find victory. All right. Oh, there is a fight here. I wasn't expecting that. Huh. Oh well. No stress damage. So we just gotta stay alive. Just gotta survive it. Let's spread the damage around as much as possible to begin with. That seems like a smart play. Might be able to kill this guy. We are indeed. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Yeah, this is certainly a shorter uh, veteran medium dungeon. We got really fortunate with the layout, seeing all three of the uh, relics early on. Typically would take a lot longer to get through one of these. We were quite fortunate. Love that. Big fan of that. I guess we do this. Certainly didn't want to do that. This might be enough. Close to it. That's pretty easy. This team seems really good. They deal a ton of damage. Obviously I have no healing, but we're making do. Wow. Destroyed. Jesus. Yeah, it's working, man. Ghoulish horrors. Brought low and driven into the mud. Go ahead and fill up, grab the crest, call it good. Cool. We did it. Alright, that was great. Let's not push our luck any further. Come on, let's this go ahead and take the W. Belongs to the light. I mean, goddamn, I got like 30 grand out of that. That was amazing. Good stuff. Level fours. All right. Oh, I got the yips, though. I gotta get rid of that. Bear not pushing his luck. I know. Who am I? The shuffling dead are silenced. We have claimed dominion over the ruins once more. There you go, buddy. Get rid of the yips. Victory Vav needs to relieve the stress. Go for that. All right, cool. Roster's full now, of course. Time to take on the Necromancer, I think. Seems like a pretty good idea. Throw a Vestal in the back line. And then another Leper. This one's ready to go, might as well. Yeah, fuck it. This is probably fine. Let's level him up. Okay. Is it possible? No, I don't think so. No chance on the, on the instructor mastery yet. No need for either of those. I will go ahead and level up Throne Dagger finally. Don't need those skills. And then her skills are all set. How are we doing on camping? You need Reflection and Quarantine. There we go. You need Gallows Humor. Snuffbox I guess I should get as well. There we go. You need to get Sanctuary. And you need to get... Experimental Vapors. Alright, there we go. Yeah. It's going fairly well. I think we're gonna have a good result at the end of this one here. It's been a good day. Good, good day. 
Let's see if I can get our fourth boss of the day taken out. That would be a pretty nice pin on things, I think. Hey man, super new to the game. Will you explain some of the reasons you're doing things or some of the reasoning for the compositions? Yeah, sure. I'll do my best. So, this composition, let's get into it right now. I love having the Plague Doctor Leper combination. I've been using it a lot lately. Just the simple ability to use the Emboldening Vapors as a plus nearly 50% damage buff to the Leper for each fight on top of his Revenge buff, giving him an additional 30. It's a common strategy a lot of people use, not just with the Leper, but like the general notion is to take a team that uh, piles a bunch of buffs onto one guy and then that one guy just obliterates everything. It works pretty well, usually. There's a couple different ways to do that. You can do that with a Leper, you can do that with a Shield Breaker, actually, and it could be pretty effective. You can probably do that with a Houndmaster, too, honestly. It wouldn't be that bad. Grave Robber's probably good for that. You got, I, got, I got a lot of options. So one of my favorite parts of this game is that there's a ton of different ways you can compose your team, and they all function with varying degrees of success. At least if you have a general idea of what you're doing. Highwayman, certainly, too. Yeah, no, that's a, that seems like a pretty damn good option. Nah, I think I... Honestly, I, I, I should give the Highwayman more love. I think I underutilize the Highwayman. Oh, her, Hellion as well, of course. Yeah, Hellion's, of course, got her own buff to apply, so... She's certainly a great option for that as well with the Adrenaline Rush. Definitely. Hellion and Highwayman, yeah, not, not my most commonly utilized uh, characters. Sell the rat. Yeah. I don't really need the money anymore. I will if I have to. He's got a quickening satchel, I didn't even realize that. Okay. So yeah, for this team in particular, on top of that uh, leopard damage, we've just got a lot of blight available to us with this composition, and blight is really, really good in the ruins. There's a lot of uh, enemies in the ruins that are vulnerable to it. You usually want get, to get a healer in the mix here, too, particularly if we're going for the boss fights. Though not always, as you've seen recently. Hey, how you doing? Just getting a little... Just getting a little more in frame for you. Alright, Necromancer time. Let's hit it. Let's do it. Two full stacks. Full stack of torches, a couple of bandages, three shovels, two keys, three holy waters, and that'll do. Let's go fight us a Necromancer. I entertained a delegation of experts from overseas eager to plumb the depths of their knowledge and share with them certain techniques and alchemical processes I had found to yield wondrous and terrifying results. Having learned all I could from my visiting guests, I murdered them as they slept. <laughs> That's another incredible waner, man. A devil walks these halls. Only the mad or the desperate go in search of him. This extra damage on top of all the buffs we're going to get, this leper is going to be madness. He's going to be a fucking force, dude. Is there a reason you don't get pickaxe on the grave robber since it's got the armor penetration? Honestly, no, not really. Like, I like this set of skills. These four are really good. The pick to the face is good, too. If you use this over, like, thrown dagger or poison darts, it's also totally viable. Especially in certain circumstances. In fact, going into the cove, you absolutely want to have it. Or even into, like, the warrens. There's a lot of stuff in the warrens that can definitely benefit from the armor armor penetration. That's a fun composition to consider, too, man. It's just, like, a full armor penetration build. Going to the cove with that. Taking out maggots, snails, and... Octocestuses, whatever those are called. Like, it's nothing. That's gonna be a that's a satisfying experience. I, I think we've even run something like that actually, and it was really nice. Okay. 
Okay. What is our priority here? Definitely stress. Which of these two is worse? It's gotta be her, right? Yeah, she does, I mean, she does like 30 a pop usually. Don't ever really want her sticking around that long. I think I typically prioritize her too. A decisive pummeling. Let's say that's usually the case. 74%, 79%, but this one's got a much higher chance of actually doing the damage for it. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. I guess we're just gonna let these guys do their thing. Bit. Yeah, 16's not that bad at all. Yeah, you're definitely the least or the less threatening one between the two of them. Well, alright, that was ideal. Thanks, game. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Yeah, let's have some fun with this. I guess I'll just top off with the best layer too. Mortality Certainly now. Clarified in a single strike. Those bleeds are gonna start becoming a lot more impactful here too. Oh, this is a huge situation, absolutely. Well struck. No question about that. Top them off. A momentary abatement. I love how the leopard doesn't even try to dodge, he just takes it to the chest and the and the enemy misses. <laughs> That intimidation factor, man. Eradicated. Good fucking lord. I mean, the 34% crit chance on top of all that. As victories mount, so too will resistance. He's just a menace, dude. Convenient. Thank you. Got a lot of fights in this dungeon, unfortunately. Wanna bandage that? Yeah, I'll be fine. Is that our third straight surprise attack? That's insane. I wanna shadow fade that. I'm gonna shadow fade that. Inspiration and improvement. Okay. Geez, Bear couldn't even get another secret room from that scout. Yeah, really slipping up now. Try to keep in line with expectations. Okay. Definitely gonna go for the lunge on the grave robber. I just can't decide who's the target. I'm pretty sure it's you. Holy hell. She's doing some damage herself, man. Good god. This team is nuts. Pop them off, let's go. No stress. The slow death. Unforeseen. Plus 12 dodge. Forgiving. That's fine. No judgment here, that's okay. Yeah. Wow. Disadvantage. Give them okay. No here we go. Seize Yo, this JD! Yes. On to the tasks end. Please, I, I would be thrilled. That is excellent news. Please come by. Please stay with us. We have a room for you. We put your names up in it. It's been waiting for you guys for years. The light. The promise of safety. That's actually four in a row? What is happening? Absurd. Yeah, yeah. A devastating blow. Oh, word. Yeah, no worries, dude. Yeah, hit me up. Compassion is exciting. a rarity in the fever pitch of battle. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Yeah, there's a lot of little details in this game like that third that are just... God, it's just so good. Darkest Dungeon's just so damn good. Such a good friggin' video game. Continue the onslaught. 
Destroy them all. Yeah, why not? No longer weakened. Oh, come on. Give it to me one time. One time. He's got 60 HP. Leopard don't give a fuck. Oh, come on. We even got it. Bear optimal on that? I thought I did the math right and everything. Damn it. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. He gave ki kind of a fuck. A little bit of a fuck. Monster's size has no intrinsic merit. Ooh. Unless inordinate exsanguination be considered a virtue. Thank you. And that one. And I guess that's it. Um Yeah. See, this is just ridiculous. Oh, I thought that was a damage buff. Still it's pretty good though. Oh, this is a damage buff. <laughs> That's a huge fucking damage buff. Oh my god, he is just gonna be ridiculous. I don't even want to camp. Just don't camp, yeah. Camp after the fight. How is every fight a surprise? We really caught him unprepared today. Good lord. That's very true, actually. Yeah, accuracy on the leper is a very nice bonus. This buff, it's not even affecting the surprise chance, or it shouldn't be, anyway. They thought you'd come on a Monday. Yeah, they were not ready for this at all. They all thought they had the day off. <laughs> like sitting here playing cards. What, what the fuck? What are you doing here? There we go. Alright. Goodbye. Destroyed. Mm-hmm. A trifling victory. But a victory nonetheless. Definitely gonna take those portraits. I think I'm actually gonna just go ahead and go to... May we find victory. No, let's keep the torches. I still want those. I might take a chance on get rid of the shovels, but... Nah, let's keep everything still. I'm gonna use the key on this chest. Okay. This is ridiculous. This is truly ridiculous. Everyone is completely shocked by our appearance. Alright. Let's get it. Let's get this shit. Let's get this shit. Eh, that's not too bad. Thank you. How about one more? Ah, damn it. Alright, Blade Doctor, fix us up. Um, that is gonna work. Plague Doctor really can't afford to do any plague grenades here. We gotta go for the bleed cure. They all had their AirPods in, yeah. Every single enemy. The blood pumps. The limbs obey. Oh god, I'm so far down. What happened? It's like a previous bear decided to tilt the camera up. Ugh. More bleed, that's not nice. Knock that off. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. Okie dokie. You're dead. Thankfully still have the blight there. Death by inches. Get rid of this bleed. Nice. One last big fat freaking heal. This dude just cannot stop whipping us. That's a big bleed on the Vestal now. God damn, that sucks. 
I have to stall this fight a little bit so I can heal that. That is not good. Absolutely got to do a battlefield medicine here. There we go. Hopefully I can stun him. Or we can just chop him to bits. Prodigious size alone does not dissuade the sharpened blade. Hey, two food, good. 1500 goddamn gold. Ah, uh, fine. The match is struck. A blazing star is born. No more torches for me. There's even more money. Alright, cool. Worth it. Ow. Cruel machinations spring to life with a singular purpose. Damn it. Yeah, I guess that's not that bad. Oh, hey, thanks. That's convenient. Hey, Neko, how you doing? Alright, I think we are just heading straight there. Actually passing on the camp this time to maintain the leper buff. Holy shit. Yeah, okay. And then... There we go. Holy hell. What a haul. What a haul. Let's do this. I think I'm ready. Nice big meals for everybody. Fill up on the good stuff. There we go. Time to face the prophet. Or not the prophet, the, the necromancer. Fierce, terrible, nightmare made material. Here we go. Oh, emboldening for sure. Start off on a good note here. This is the town of that buff. Yeah, it gives us resolve experience and damage for the run. Very low chance on the stun there. Like the damage. And it's revenge time. What do you think that paper is? A shopping list? This is his list of people that have wronged him. Everyone that's ever mildly insulted him in his life. And we're at the very top. It's a CBS receipt, yeah. Oh, he can't fucking target anything. Uh-oh. That's... That's not good. Ugh. Pretty sure this guy's just Santa Claus. I like that, yeah. That's an interesting way to look at it. This, he's, he could be this world, or this universe is Santa Claus. I believe that. He's got the list, the red clothes. Yeah, it's all there. He's probably got a big old beard underneath that hood. Their belly slapping around everywhere. You don't want those presents. Yeah, you, know, you, don't, you don't want this guy coming down your chimney. Still can't do anything, but they're not doing anything, so who gives a shit, I guess. This is a weird fight so far. He just keeps doing that, too. He's gonna bring the same fucking summon or stealthy skelly boys every time. Got two more rounds of that crap. Good, good, good. Hey, finally. Annihilated. One down, bare optimal. Do, 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 do. He brings out the stealth boners. I want to make a joke about having a lot of those in high school. Yeah, all right, I did it. It happened. Those weren't stealthy. <laughs> those, those weren't nearly as stealthy as you thought, Bear. <laughs> Decimated. Alright, this is going pretty well. 
Nice. Yeah, it's close to a resolve check, but what are you gonna do? I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna kill the Necromancer. Get a bunch of blight on him. That was the problem. I went to high school with Malph. Every time I popped a boner, you would always be there like, Everybody look! Look at his boner! A momentary abatement. God, I wish I went to high school with Malph. What a, what a experience that would have been. Maybe if the leopard didn't use a broken fucking sword, he'd hit more. Yeah. There's some logic there. That was pretty tame in high school. I, I don't believe it. I bet you were a little, little scamp. Always getting into mischief. Parking the principal's car on the roof, that kind of stuff. Classic mouth move. Goodbye. With no living sinew to actuate them, will these walking bones finally fail? Goodbye. Ooh, blueprint. Sweet. Uh, I guess we do this. Right. Yeah. Okay. Cool. I did it. Let's camp. Huddled together. Furtive and vulnerable. Rats in a maze. Let's prevent that ambush. We're gonna do a little quarantine areno. Gonna go for the uh Encourage on you. Encourage on you. Nice. That was pretty effective. Great. All right. The way is lit. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. Little, a little more. Little, little bit more. Little more. Little bit more. We got this. This team's really good. I got four food. I'll be fine. I already scouted it. Won't be a problem. It's going well today, yeah. I'm having a good time in the dungeon today. Much, much better than yesterday. That's for damn sure. Knocked out a lot of bosses today, too. Yeah, it felt really good. Real happy with that. There's that press your luck thing everyone's talking about. Yeah, so this is, uh... Well, there's the four food we had for this exact purpose, but this is the thing that normally you definitely should not do, especially when there's really little reason to do it at all. Trying to get like a little bit more money or something out of this, I suppose, is my justification for it. Totally not worth it, especially having this little stress when we could have just left and been in that kind of shape. Definitely leave the right thing to do. I mean, honestly, this is probably just more for the entertainment value at this point. I almost certainly wouldn't be doing this if I wasn't if I wasn't streaming. Eh, it's probably an unlikely result there. Let's just heal him up or heal her up. I just want to chop this guy. Keep on chopping. Yeah. Nearly there. Just keep him, keep him in fighting shape. That's all we really need. Masterfully executed. Keep his spirits up. Not a problem. Slowly, gently. Ooh boy. This is how a life is taken. Nice. That went well. That's good, white flags. Yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to it. We will be doing that uh, after the dungeoning today for sure. I think I'll do one or two more uh, runs today though before we wrap up and head into the crossword. I mean, like, why would you not, if you're this enemy, why would you not do that move literally every time? The bigger the beast, 
You got an AoE hit that hits for as much as your normal hit that can stun every party member. Clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Fucking duh, of course you're gonna use that skill. Uh I mean I think I already have one of these ones actually, so I think I'd rather just do that. And see what that is. Nice. Um it's a thousand gold, who cares? There we go. Yay. Good stuff. Great result there. Level five. Holy cow, yeah, they got 11 experience out of that. No kidding. Nearly level six on these two. And musical, oh, fun. Oh, I got the yips again though, and tapeworm, yikes. Yeah, that's no fun. Rough. I can still see their angry faces as they stormed the manor. But I was dead before they found me. And the letter was on its way. Okay. Good. Man, the bank is really working, huh? God damn, that has been immediately one of the best investments we've made. Do you have a man at arms near level five? I don't think so. I'm pretty sure a man at arms, yeah, they're both at level one still. Could stand to try to level one of those guys up. <sighs> All right, yeah, no stagecoach either. For real, yeah, I really turned it around from yesterday. Absolutely. I like doing a Warren's Grain Sack run. Oh no, hold on. Let's do this. Let's do the Easy Wield Medicine Gather. And then that'll allow us to do... No, actually, this isn't going to give us a wield buff, is it? But I think I'd like to do this anyway. So we can level up our Man-at-Arms. Let's do a Highwayman run. I haven't seen him in a minute. And a Cultist. Let's get the fresh occultist out there. And... Yeah, repost team here, huh? Yeah, that seems like a fun idea. Hey, a jester too, why not? That sounds like a good time. Cool. Let's do it. Let's level these guys up real quick. Assuming they've got anything to do. This one real fast. And I gotta check their guild skills. Upgrade that, upgrade that, upgrade that, upgrade this and this. So he's all set. You're good to go. I'm gonna upgrade your defender as well. The cultist needs all these unlocked. Jester's got the finale he needs. Oh, he needs inspiring tune as well and dirk stab shit. Okay, you've got that. You're gonna go boom and then boom. And I think I'm gonna use the pole actually on this team. Finale's ready. We're gonna go with that in this. And then. We got two blanks in this party. Yeah, that's kind of funny. What are the odds? Alright, we gotta get rid of the yips on someone here too. Isn't that Queen of Sprinkles? Yeah. There we go. It might be worth it, actually, to consider new slots in the sanitarium. I do have the right things for this, after all. Patient cells, honestly. I mean, it's so cheap. I think the I might as well do that. The of this war is not in the dungeon, but rather inside the mind. Oh, for the patient cells, it's pretty cheap, too, actually. Yeah, let's do that. I should have done that a while ago, probably. Team name shooting blanks. Yeah, that's good. I love that you both thought of that. That's so funny. Let's see. I've got to have a worse thing to get rid of. I mean, there's bad ones, don't get me wrong, but nothing stands out as I need to get rid of this. I think I'm going to do Claustrophobia and Egomania. Okay. Alright, then. Knights! Thank you very much for the 18 months on the pile. Welcome on back into you. 
Bear hugs are always lovely to see. Thank you for the support. Thank you for the subscription. Man in arms with a tough ring. The cultists with Junia's head and the Corrigian's charm. We're not going to go with those crazy buffs this time. Uh, I don't really want Tyrant's finger bone on him. I think I'd rather go with Lucky Dice and then maybe like the Bloodthirst Ring or something. And then Highwayman just take the Surgical Gloves, I guess. He will use those. I'm going to Duelist Advance on him quite a bit. Okay. This should be fun. One more trinket on the Man at Arms here. Stun Amulet, sure. We'll use Rampart a bit. Okay. Off to the wheel. Let's gather some medicine. I'm ready. Feeling a lot more uh, prepared, a lot better about these runs today. Certainly compared to last time. Let's do it. Let's go. Rack up another quick dubski, dude. It's ought to be fairly fast. Our land is remote and unneighbored. Every lost resource must be recovered. Especially if we get another fortunate layout. We already got one quest location, so... That bodes well. Yeah, we can afford to buy things. Isn't that nice? In Radiance, may we find victory. The bank is more or less, I think, just going to take care of our financial issues for the rest of the run, so... That feels really good. I think I just need to ignore those. Almost always. Hey, we actually have stress healing on this team, too. And he hit us with a squid punish. That's always nice. One down. Vintner next, next district. Probably, yeah. Get the blood supply taken care of, too. It would certainly feel good. Uh, yeah, let's just get a repose going. Crazy guy walking his... Crazy guy walking his dogs. Yeah, I like that. Good narrative here. Right, we'll do a stress heal and a group heal. Not a group heal, but... A cultist solo heal on the highwayman after that bleed trigger. Well, hold on. We can probably just stab this thing out. Ah, damn. Not worth it. Grievous injury, palpable fear. Well, already kind of hurting. Definitely gonna keep the stress heals going early. Let's be safe. I don't think there's much reason to take chances on our HP here. Hey, nice. Wow. Yeah, let's keep stress healing too. It is giving me a decent opportunity here for it. Hopefully Crush is enough. God damn it. I should have just point blank shot the whole time. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Oh well. How many characters have reposts? Two. And you're looking at them. I'm pretty sure. Right? I think. Is there a character that can give another character repost? Is that a modded character? What am I thinking of? That was the airship mod, okay. Wow, 12 food. For a task well performed. Holy hell. Alright, there's one. So good. All right. Cool. Excellent. 
executed with impunity. That'll work. I think you're thinking of Black Reliquary with giving your leper repost. I probably am, yeah. A leper with repost by default is just... It's just absurd to consider. Have we done a Mark team in this campaign? Not really, not yet. That's certainly a direction we could go. Another abomination cleansed from our lands. Mark parties are a lot of fun, yeah. Kind of re revolves this around that same idea. At least promises success. Well, not really. It's, it sounds similar, but they're very different. Of. The idea of either building around one person to deal all the damage, or just centering all of the damage on one enemy. Which, you know, is typically what you want to be doing anyway. A time to perform beyond one's limits. Alright, I might get lucky with the repost there. Actually, let's do this. Eh, I'm just gonna take the rampart or even the crush, actually. Yes, yeah, let's do that. Continue the onslaught. Hey, Moth. Destroy them all. All right, here comes a little bit of stress. Or a party shuffle. There we go, not too bad. Nice. Advance for sure. Another bear optimal, baby. I'm gonna keep stress healing here, even though it probably would be better to do the Dirk stab, but I wanna allow the uh, highwayman to get back up front. Trying to counter this additional stress a little bit at least. Their formation is broken. Maintain oh, the offensive. Damn. Oh good, okay. Got one at least. Nice. That's more or less uh gonna take care of the back liner there. Inspiration and improvement. Uh, I don't know why I thought that actually. Well, As apparently that's why. Falls, a faint hope blossoms. Yippee! Good job, team. Two blood, nice. Success so clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Damn it. I thought that was a shovel interaction. Well, hopefully that doesn't come back to bite me. Here we go. Nice. Come on, quest location. Yep, nice. And another one? Nope. That is a really good start. And talking shit at the end of it, too. What a badass. Okay. There is no hope. He very clearly said there is no hope at the end of that. That was, like, even more obvious than normal. I heard that one distinctly. There is no Hulk! <laughs> The Marvel Cinematic Universe is fiction! What? My life is a lie! I thought I'd be able to walk outside and see Captain America at my front door! He's not real! No! no Ow. I thought those were documentaries. <laughs> God damn this stress, man. Letting that pile up. God damn it. There we go. 
I think I'd notice 50% of humanity disappearing. Yeah, but would you? Like, really, would you? Be, be honest. I don't know if I would. I don't think I would. Not immediately, anyway. Right now, fucking, of course not. Wouldn't have a goddamn clue. I guess if a close family member were to disappear all of a sudden, certainly you'd notice then. These nightmarish creatures can be felt. They can be beaten. Yeah, we gotta do that. I mean, I'm gonna have to get rid of something here, too. I'm probably just gonna camp out now, actually. Seems like a pretty good idea. A moment of respite. A chance to steel oneself against the coming horrors. Oh, I don't have any kind of ambush prevention, do I? I do have every rose has its thorn, which is really nice. And, oh, nice, we have bandit sense, hell yeah. And clean guns. Good shit. Okay, that'll work. The way is lit. The path is clear. Thank you. We require only the strength to follow it. All right, so we do still have to go that way, unfortunately. Glittering gold. Trinkets and baubles. Paid for in blood. Nature herself. A victim to the spreading corruption. No! Misintent. Anything but that! Back to the pit. Heavens! Her my! The maggots! I've arrived again! Be gone, fiend! Of course, there's a good chance that you yourself would disappear. I mean, I think I speak for all of Twitch chat when I say, Bring it on! Zap me away, motherfucker! If I can just dissolve into nothingness? You kidding me? <laughs> Seize this momentum. Push on. That's the dream, dude. End. You know it. Sweet, sweet release. <laughs> I'm kidding. I don't want to die. I just want to dissolve into the ether. <laughs> Destroyed. Ah, keep stressing on. What if it actually felt great getting dissolved? Oh god, yeah. Just like super relaxing, right? Oh, this is so nice! I don't even mind it! They're optimal, baby. Return to the great tranquility. That's a, that's a nice way of deciding that's what happens. Let's just go ahead and consider that cannon. Bonk. You just want to take a three-year nap? Well, that's like what Bo says in the special, right? Like, if you could just cryo-sleep for 18 months. I wouldn't do it now, but there are definitely times in my life where I would have considered it as a... Obliterated. ...as a viable option. Trifling victory, but a victory nonetheless. I like my life now. I'm pretty happy right now. I'm, I'm, I'm having a good time. I would prefer not to fast forward, actually, if that's an option. It's kind of already happening, though. As a result of getting older, time's just passing faster. And there doesn't seem to be anything I can do to stop that. It's a bunch of bullshit. Wake, wake you up when personal robots are a thing. That's the threshold we want to get to. Pummeling. What do you need a personal robot for? What do you want? Okay, if you had a personal robot right now to do anything for you, what would you have it do? Like, the one thing you would have it do for you that you wouldn't have to do it anymore for yourself. Cleaning and cooking. Okay, sure. Yeah, those seem like pretty obvious choices. Now, yeah, now that you mention it. Cooking bot would be pretty terrific. Oh god, now- oh no, I need that. Oh shit, yeah, go ahead and just put me in cryo sleep too real fast. 
Now that we've identified that as something that I absolutely need in my life. A robot that can just cook every meal for me? Oh my god. Are you kidding me? What I wouldn't give. Take the dog out to potty. No! I want to have my time with my dog. Plus I got a dog door anyway. So it doesn't apply to my situation, so therefore you can't want it, is what I'm trying to say. Do the dishes, I hate that. I mean, a dishes robot, yeah, that'd certainly be nice too. Hey, that's called a dishwasher, right? Ha 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 ha. No, but also the part where you have to scrub them too still sucks. You made it, Rainy. Just in time for what might be the last dungeon of the day. How 1% of you owning a dishwasher. I know, I'm sorry. I'm really showing my privilege there. There's gotta be... A, a, dish, a dishwashing robot must already exist, yeah. It's probably being used at the corporate level somewhere. Save some fucking time that way, dude. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Do, do, do. It's called a wife? You take that comment, you you take it as a physical thing and shove it straight back down your throat, okay? Even if it was a joke. Just ram that shit right back down your gullet. And then shit it out and cast it out into the ocean because that's where it needs to be. That's where that opinion and comment belongs. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. No, no, not not a good joke, I'm afraid. I don't like it. Give me that third one right here, right there. That's it, right? That's it. That's it. That's it. We got it. Let's go. Gimme, gimme, gimme. I knew this one be easy. I knew it wouldn't be a problem. This squad's got it taken care of, dude. We don't even have any stress anymore. Look at this. Look at this. Amazing. I don't have shovels, right? Yeah, so definitely time to go. Unless... Maybe I could do one more. Just one more real curio. Just get a little green. It's just totally fine. It's totally fine. It's okay. There we go. All good. Now we leave. Now we've done it. Goodbye. These medicines will prevent the outbreak of epidemic at our struggling hamlet. Indeed. Yes. Quite so. Here, here. I wish that mattered. That does, though, unfortunately. That's pretty bad. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of that. The preponderance of rare nice. and exotic injuries makes this place perfect for the study of suffering. Well, it's quite convenient that I, uh, decided to get those unlocks right before this, huh? That's certainly good. Kind of makes me want to go for the fourth one, but eh, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do that. Oh well. Yeah, locking in positives is free too. We gotta take advantage of that for sure. I wanna do that on some of our higher rank guys. Luminous. That's one we can get. That's a pretty damn good contender. Get rid of uh, flawed release. Lock in Luminous. That is huge. And then... Let's see. Ooh, slow reflexes is pretty bad. I think I'd much rather get rid of something that's locked in already, though. Like Ashen, for example, is a good option for sure. Hard Noggin's not bad either. I could, I could go for the lock in there. That's not bad. Ooh, Precise Striker. There we go. And then we can get rid of Claustrophobia, too. There's a winner. Nice. 
I guess it probably would have been better to get rid of one of the ones that are locked in. Yeah, Bloodthirsty was the choice there. That was kind of stupid. I can cancel this and still do it for free, right? Yes. Okay, cool. Yay. No disease on the party. That's nice to see. A rare sight. Cool. This will be the fifth boss of the day, right? If we were to knock out the Swine King here too. Let's do it, man. Mega boss day. Yeah, I don't even need to relieve stress at all. We got one Vestal with a little bit. It's not even necessary. Let's do it, dude. Sculptor's Duels, which is always such a fucking weird trinket. Let's put this team together. Let's go with... I like a bleed squad for this. Flagellant, Houndmaster, Vestal. And then I guess... The Plague Doctor? Maybe? 40% damage versus Stonework, which is one very specific fight in the end game. Doesn't really ever matter beyond that. Oh, Jester would be good here. Put his Harvest on? Yeah, I like that play. And then get the finale involved, too. Oh, and the Gargoyles, too, right? Yeah, I guess it matters for them. Are they Stonework? I'm pretty sure they are, actually. Yeah, I think they are. Into the guild with them. Still really need to upgrade this. I kind of want to... No, I still... I need more crests. More crests, more portraits. Level 4 skills would be really good. Let's get the Hound's Harry upgrade. Harvest and slice off. And you know, I'm probably just going to use harvest. Okay. Hmm. This team's probably fine. Let's check the camping skills real fast. All good. Therapy dog, definitely worth getting. I had to check to see if one of my dogs was here. I'm all alone. Jesters are good. And hey. Chant time? Hmm. I think I'd rather have the encourage on her, actually. Wait, hold on. Yeah, encourage just sort of feels better. I guess pray is okay. Yeah, pray's a little bit better. Let's do pray. Pray is certainly better than the uh, pep talk. All right, cool. Trinket time. Let's do it. What's this one do? Bleed resist and max HP. Oh, and blight resist too. Versus bleed skill chance and damage boost. Yeah, I'm gonna take that. Hey, Tam. Going pretty well today. I'm happy. This will be our fifth boss if we're able to knock this one out as well. Really cruising today. Bloodthirst ring and the heal boost. Here we go. Let's do it. Time to fight the Swine King. Actually, now that I think about it, this is the Swine King. Let's do this instead. Let's do a Musketeer. That's going to be a lot better. Didn't think about that. Mm-hmm. Do you there, and then you're going to go like this. And... Oops, not that. Just need to give you that, and... Oh, yeah, we have this thing now, too. Eh, it still needs the mark. I think I'd rather just give her the crit chance. There we go. All right, cool. Go skeet shot. Works for me. 
I gotta, aim, I gotta probably just equip that at the beginning of the fight. There we go. Time to hit it. Off to the Swine King. Works for me. Let's go. My first attempts at summoning were crude, and the results disappointing. I soon found, however, that the type and condition of the host's meat was a critical factor. The best results came from pigs, whose flesh is most like that of man. Delicious. A nameless abomination. A testament to my failures. It must be destroyed. Can I lay out again here for the boss? It's been a common theme. And we're getting the scout too. I'll take a hallway fight instead. Yeah, that's probably better. I swear to God, we've been surprising like every single fight. A singular strike. I'm not complaining. I'm just confused. Stun? Yep, oh well. Uh, let's just do that. Precision and power. Heck of a freaking start, man. Munch. Wow. Can't even deal any damage. Gonna blackjack this guy too. Alright, there we go. Problem solved, I guess. Holy hell. They're all surprised you're playing still after yesterday. Yeah, they thought they completely destroyed my, uh, my motivation. Thought they left me high and dry. Little did they know, I still have to do this for a living. In Radiance, may we find victory. It certainly makes sense to try to get rid of Warren's phobe right now. That's still good. Nah, i kind of fallen out of favor with No Man's Sky again, Seymour. I've actually been playing a lot of New World, weirdly enough. I did not expect to get into that, but I have. It's been fun. I've been playing on an alt account on that so that I can just sort of play it for fun and not really worry about, you know, like being bear taffy and making content. But having done that a lot more, I uh, have been tempted, actually, to just go ahead and boot up New World as Bear Tap. You can do a little bit of streaming of it, too. Because I like it. It's taking my life. I just want to get to 100 mining. Same. I, I'm at 97. I'm so goddamn close. I want that freaking star medal. Press this advantage. RuneScape no stream. Now, I think we're still far away from that, but... This, uh, I, I'm, I'm enjoying having New World. It's really nice. God damn, dude. Another MMO numbers simulator. Yeah, no, I'm the, like, I can't really justify it either is the thing thinking about it. Because it's very much just an MMO and it fo follows all those same tropes. It's just scratching my itch somehow. Hey, there we go. You like Far Cry 6 too, Tim, really? I've been thinking about checking that out as well. Although I feel like I've played plenty of Far Cry now in my life. And those experiences have felt very samey over the years. Yeah, let's do that. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. Scratching your MMOH, I'm sure there's a cream for that. <laughs> I hope so. Uh, we probably don't need the herbs. Yeah, that's kind of how I'm feeling with it lately, Tam. For a task well performed. I mean, the fact that uh, Giancarlo Esposito is in it is a pretty strong motivator. And I think they know that. But even that, I don't know if it if it's enough. He's a fantastic villain. I mean, of fucking course he is. Alright. Let's 
clear this out and camp out and get this done. Can he just play every villain from now on? He pretty much is. The light. The promise of safety. It's, it's already happening. You, you don't even have to try to will it into existence. And I'm rarely disappointed by it, so... A spark without kindling. More power to him. It's a goal without hope. Alright, prevent the ambush. No need to stress heal here, actually. Go ahead and go for the uh, accuracy and dodge. The marching plan is pretty damn solid, and then... Let's go with, uh... An encourage, I guess. Sure. Here we go. The match is struck. A blazing star is born. Got a lot of portraits this run, too. That's nice. Some crests, too. That feels good. Alright, we got some nice... Buffs on the Houndmaster. Speed buff for the party. This should be pretty good. Gonna make sure I get the skeet, sh skeet shot equipped, though. Alright, cool. Let's do it. I think Hound's Harry is worse than Guard Dog in this situation, too. Let's do it! It is a travesty. A blundering mountain of hatred. We're talking about old bear rage. games. We should talk about what I started on. That one game about... Oh, you're talking about Sir, You Were Being Hunted. Those were fun streams. That was like 2013, 2014. Holy hell. Feels like a lifetime ago. Doggy treat. Alright, yeah, so she's marked, unfortunately, so that means we're probably just gonna have to take a shot. Um, I could try to stun him. It's almost certainly not gonna happen. West of Loathing. Oh, wow. The YouTube series. Such a terrible assault. Jesus Christ, okay. JC! Photo! Thank you for the two months. JC, welcome back. Appreciate the resubscription. Bear hugs for him. I'm gonna be a little, uh, careful here. Give myself a cushion. Now we'll be able to use the, uh, Mark clear, thankfully. Sedated. Less of loving was a great time, yeah. I've given some thought every now and then to uh, doing another exclusive YouTube series. Way back when that DLC came out was about when I started to uh, slow down on YouTube and just more focus on Twitch stuff. Oh, that's unfortunate. It's gonna be a problem. Mm. I should probably heal. A momentary abatement. All right, here we go. Ringing ears. Not that bad, actually. The end approaches. Better than I thought it would be. He's, he's like, figured out our strategy now, too. He's, like, acting like he knows what to do. He's trying to take the Musketeer's mark clear out of the equation. Oh, that actually doesn't really matter, then. He can target that. That's fine. There we go. Truly, this is go! The dungeon. Mercy, meow! Thank you for the 420. About to hit that medicinal herb, if you know what I mean. Hey! Thanks for the tip. Appreciate it. Welcome on... Or, sorry. No, no sub there, but... Thank you. It truly is the dankest dungeon. I might as well just do this, I think. No reason not to. Hey, there we go. Not like her damage is all that significant anyway. It's really all about the bleed here. All about the bleed. Nice. That certainly helps. Impressive. Yeah, more or less seals the deal there. 
Lock him in five rounds of 20 damage. Good to go. Thank you, Mercy. Bit of squealing. A wee, a wee bit of squealing. That's a goodbye to the Swine King, baby. Hell yes. Love to see it. A momentary abatement. Crushed it, dude. Hardly even felt the pain at all. Easy peasy. That'll, that'll be my character voice in Darkest Dungeon 2, yeah. Blimey! Oh, it's a bit of a stinky wicket, isn't it? Heal him up. The wounds of war can be healed, but never hidden. If you do that British accent this again, I'm unfollowing. At least promises success. Oh, bloody hell! Apologies. <laughs> hey, I did it. Ugh. Five bosses. Five. Five bosses on the day. Pretty good. Pretty freaking good, dude. Feeling better? Some leveling up? Eagle Eye, that's nice. Cool. Right on. Perhaps things are not as bad as they seem. Don't laugh. <laughs> Oh, now I feel bad. Man. Red play, gotta get rid of that. Alright, yeah, that is... That feels like a good way to... To wrap up the Darkest Dungeon Day. Let's do a couple bounties real quick. But also, I gotta say... <clears throat> gotta clear my throat. And say thank you for watching. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching the Darkest Dungeon series so far in the final campaign. Looking forward to more. Come on back uh, Monday, 9 a.m. Pacific, is when we'll continue this. Appreciate all the support. Big time.